This boy is gonna be sitting out in the cold. Okay! Well, we did it, guys. What's up, man? Bill? Morning. How are you feeling? Mm, so so. All right. Well, that's good enough, I suppose. All right. Guess we're gonna go over here and do this mission. What's <coughs> good? Starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. Oh, we need Four. more. 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pierce. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. Oh, boy. When we ran away that from Black damn mustache. I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. Yeah. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. Ha! That is. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found nothing. Enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. All right. Let's do it, man. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. <laughs> Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. All right, Charles. <coughs> that bow, though. Yeah. You take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. Yep, that's true. I'm never too old to learn, I imagine. Come on. All right, this way. Let's do it. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. Mm. Uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. You're gonna get a hang of it with me. You reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Okay, Charles. See, Charles, he knows what he's talking about, bro. Been a wild few days, all right. Mm-hmm. That right north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John, that thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. Mm-hmm. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me either. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. Okay, we're going up the mountain. What the heck is that in the snow? Is that just a rock, I guess, or a tree? A part of a tree? God, Le let me know in the comments, are you where it's snowing really bad? Where do you guys live? If so, what, what's the weather like right now for you guys? This shit's making me want some hot chocolate. Like seriously, some hot, hot chocolate. I'm just, mm, get me all cold. It won't be long and it'll be Christmas time. The holiday season is on us. All right. Yeah. See some of the ground uncovered here. Come on, let's try this way. Okay. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. I'm looking. Hmm. I'm not seeing any movement yet. Too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, it won't move. 
No, shh. Stay quiet. Okay. Hey, stop here a second. I see something. You see something? Where? Oh, watch it. Okay. What you see over here? here? Recently. How can you tell? Yeah. How can you not? Let's walk it from here. Oh, okay. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. All right, all right. Everything around. All right, I'm taking my bow. Let's do this. As you can. Stay low and move slowly. All right. See the tracks? I don't think so. Maybe not. Focus. Ah. Keep your head down. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. He's this way. You know, I do think hunting is cool and all, but it just gotta be so slow. I see the deer. I see the deer. Wait, look. There they are. Are you ready with that bow? Aim for their head or neck. We want a good, clean kill. Get good tension on the string before releasing. Just... Don't overdo it. Okay. Take the shot. Shit. I, 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 hold on. Wait a minute. Okay. Ready? Shit. It won't stay steady enough. Damn it. Uh, unlucky. Take your time. Ah! This pisses me off. How's that way? I see them. Got it. Okay. Got it. Mm. Ha ha. Kill it. 
We should go finish it off. Shit. Darn it! Come on! Gonna try to track it again. I know, but it hurts. Oh, no. The poor Bambi deer. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. Oh. You show your hands okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. Come here, horse. I'm actually tearing up a bit. It was so sad to see that deer suffering. Jesus. Some of you are like, Vegeta, stop being a pussy! Shut up. It was saddening, okay? Come here, horsey. Come here, my black steed. Okay. There you go. Pretty good hunt there, boy. Good job. All right, come on, boy. We gotta meet up with Charles. At least we got some food for everyone. Yep. Yep. We had to go up the mountain. All right. He's already got his. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, man. Let's head back. Ow. Rock. Nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. That's good. Uh, careful. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Just needed it's the practice. When they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Hopefully. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain. Could it be the vitamin D giving us luck? People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm -mm. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. That's right. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? Why is that? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Why is that? More than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. Oh boy. One more. We ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful <laughs> kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. Mm. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Hopefully. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. Ha! <laughs> Well, I know who my money's on in that fight. Yeah, the woman. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? Mm -mm. I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, 
That's a long story. We've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Yeah, I can tell. Their leader, Cole, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. We must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep over. What are you doing? Get him! Yeah. <laughs> Come on, bear! Ah! What the fuck? My horse! No! Horsey! No! <laughs> that actually made me laugh really funny. Oh god, that made me die. Thank you. Never talked to. How much, you me? How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But he didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Yep. Nature of life. Ain't that the I truth? I thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone. No problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. She's certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. But for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, nah. that ain't normally the case. Well, that we sucks. Need you now. Or never. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Long you time. Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. <laughs> taught me to read. John, too. Taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. Yeah, well, I mean, not gonna lie, kind of seems like he's gonna go down and not be the same kind of person by the end of it all. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. It's kind of <laughs> sad because we couldn't kill the bear. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. Ah, uh, we didn't get to kill the bear, guys. Easy. I'm gonna hitch time over here. Brought some food back, boys. Hey there. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. I uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. Yep. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. That dog! The horse is pooping! The horse pooped! That's just funny. Well, well, well. Just drop it down in here. Doesn't matter? Alright. What a surprise. 
I found a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. Oh, oh my. Me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. <laughs> get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. He's nothing see but a drunk. Just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <laughs> you always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. All right, man. You skin that one, you get dumped on the floor there. All right, gonna skin the deer. All right, here we go. I get all the guts out. Yep. Huh. Not too bad, Mister Moore. Yeah, very fast. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Uh, right I know I'm that. just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah. Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Everyone's got to put Take in the work. Good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. Ain't that the truth? <laughs>